Hello everybody and welcome back to X4, where I think, I think, I got our uh, employed ship working correctly, making us passive income. Now it's working over here, and I don't quite know why, but, um, what, what's happening here? What are you currently doing? You're attempting to dock. You're just kind of freaking out. Okay. Is the game paused? The game is not paused. Okay, it was working until I started recording. That's exciting. Let's try pausing and unpausing. Still just freaking out. It might be freaking out about this. Now that I think about it. Wait, did it just... We just got paid. Okay, looks like it was docking. Perfect. So, we have a source of passive income here. There are no current mission offers here right now, but we do have 128,000 credits. So we actually, I should have done this off camera, but we need to head over to the Argon Wharf. So let's just head over there. Like I said, I really should have done that off camera. I just did not think about it. But I suppose we can head over and see if we can find any missions along the way, and in the meantime, our passive income should result in us getting at least some money on the way over. So now that that's in place, that frees us up dramatically to work on the uh, main story here, just so that we can get our headquarters set up. So, while we're on our way over, the autopilot is going to attempt to avoid asteroids, mostly unsuccessfully. <laughs> and I'm just checking over here. Yep, it looks like our miner is back mining this ice field over here. So that is perfect. We may want to swing over here and drop a resource probe and a satellite over here. The trading station... Does not appear to purchase ice, but whatever. Okay. So, we are on our way over, and once we get onto the superhighway, it'll go pretty quickly to get up there. And in the meantime, I just want to keep a bit of an eye on our courier here. It is currently flying, allegedly, but I think it's actually mining. Now I wish, is there like a message log? I know there's a message log here somewhere. Is it in player information? Logbook. Okay, excellent. So we successfully made about 9,000 credits. That's not very much. But it's nice and passive. So that means that that will take a little while to pay for itself. And that's ultimately fine. So we'll fly on over and look for some missions to do while we are on the way. I'll check in on the courier now. It is doing something. Entering system. Okay, so ice it has ice. successfully gathered its ice and it is now heading over to trade the ice, this time with this ice refinery over here. That's fine. That is just fine. So we should be able to largely ignore that and hope that it doesn't get blown up by pirates before we get our investment back. But for now, we can just head on over to the wharf, and we're going to attempt to purchase the cheapest ship that we possibly can. And that will be ideal. Are there any missions around here? Not currently. Okay. And yeah, we're going to get another 8,661 credits, slightly less than last time. But that is perfectly fine. I 
Excellent. The next thing that we might want to get for some passive income is a trading ship to have it automate trades. But that would, of course, happen after we complete the, uh, at least this stage of the main quest. Entering system. Pontifex's claim. There are items in my inventory that are illegal here. That's okay. We're just booking our way through. Shouldn't really have any problem with this, in theory. Preventative measures. Destroy criminal traffic over there. This is for the Holy Order of the Pontifex, so, and some of the stuff that we have is illegal for them. Entering so we'll probably system. avoid that for now. Sight. This one is again Holy Order of the Pontifex. So we will just head on through. Autopilot. Disentering system. Second contact. Autopilot. Not sure why the autopilot turned itself off there, but whatever. Ship seizure? No, that's not something I'm interested in. Entering system. Argon Prime. Okay, so here's Argon Prime. Valuable deposits. Hmm. No, I don't think that's something that we're going to do just now. That's just, like, mining manually and transporting mining or miners around. That's not something I'm too Venator. interested in Vanguard. currently. Argon Wharf. Autopilot. Disengaged. Okay. So let's just flip around. Request some docking permission. Docking granted. Excellent. And in we go. Just come on right over here. And we'll just get docked right on up. About like that. Okay, so the reason that we are here is because we need to see the cheapest ship that we can possibly get. And I'm wondering what the cheapest ship is. So this is 113... Thousand. This is ninety nine thousand, hundred and seventy thousand, hundred and seven, hundred and three, and two hundred and one. So this interceptor here, the Elite Vanguard, which is what we're currently flying, is the cheapest ship available. Of course, we would need to put the worst engines possible on it. We would need to put the worst thrusters possible on it. We would need to put in some flight assist software, long range scanner, basic scanner, and a targeting software on it. Like that. So that's 187,878 credits is what we need. Okay. Let's just check to see here if any of the things that we're selling could be purchased. Yeah. These goods here. We don't, of course, want to get rid of our antimatter cells, but these advanced electronics and energy cells can definitely be sold here. So we'll do that. That'll get us a little bit more from the trading. Are there antimatter converters? Hang on. I feel like we had antimatter cells in this. Let's see here. Do we have to go get antimatter cells again? Uh, these are player inter information. I want information on the Elite Vanguard. Yeah, we've got these antimatter cells right here. Okay. So that's fine. Nothing else that we have on our Elite Vanguard can be uh, sold here, which the only thing that we have on here is actually the antimatter cells. So we've managed to sell everything else, which is great. 
And we're still about 40,000 credits short. Hmm, some of these. Medical emergency. Find lockbox, collect items, deliver items. That seems easy. Or we can just find ore in Argon Prime. This is even easier. And it actually pays slightly better. We'll accept this. I knew I could count on you. We will undock. And we will get on out of here. Technically, we want to get out this direction, looks like. Okay. And let's just skedaddle on out. Later, nerds. Oh, hello. I just saw a pirate over here briefly. It appears to be gone. We'll just go after this uh, find ore in Argon Prime. Where does it want us to do this? It wants us to do it over here? Okay. Autopilot engaged. We'll head on over. That'll get us what we need, and then we can get our cheapest ship. Cheapest possible ship, even. Um, Autopilot, what exactly are you doing? You know what? Tell you what. We'll just come over here. Excellent. This should get us enough in theory, right? I'm just wondering where... It actually has this specific location. But I think this would be fine. We do have... This is our only resource probe. Okay, that was fine. Fantastic. So let's head on back to the wharf. And now we can continue with our mission. Now, do we want to have a pilot for that? Is there a way we can just have it follow us? I want to check our mission manager. We will, of course, set this to active. We're flying to the Argon Wharf. <laughs> okay. So it needs to have three antimatter cells in it. And it's currently in our ship. So that's going to be interesting. Well, we're still accelerating towards the wharf here. And we now know that we have enough credits to make this happen. The real question is, do we want to upgrade our ship and have this be the ship that we deliver? I don't know. Uh, autopilot, can you uh, maybe not run us directly into the station? Thanks. <laughs> okay, so we will request docking permission. And we're going to head up over here, of course. Okay, same pad. Autopilot. Uh, autopilot, no, please don't do that. Thank you. <laughs> okay, we'll just line up like so. We'll go forward a little bit. About like that. A little bit more forward. There we go. Perfect. So now we need to get ourselves a suitable ship. Successfully docked. And we have 205,000 credits currently. So we can purchase the Elite Vanguard. Alternately, we could buy something maybe a little bit better, or we could just get this absolute minimum spec, as I was before. And I think we'll do that for now, because I think we can't really afford to get a halfway decent ship. We get a pilot here, I guess. Add that to our shopping list. And confirm that. Okay. 
So we'll now hop over to the map. And this here, this elite vanguard, I want to... Can we drop our inventory here and carry it over? Specifically, I want to... Hmm. Specifically, I want to move over those antimatter cells. Can we just transfer that from same station? Or would we have to manually walk it over? I guess we'll find out. Let's Let's go ahead and drop this for now. Elite Vanguard and see where it put it. Is it over here? Did it put it into a station inventory? I'm not sure. This is, I believe, our new Vanguard, right? No, this is the old one. The new one is down there, I think. Let's see. Okay. The container is allegedly around here somewhere. Okay, I may have completely lost the container. Where do I go to get that? It wants me to fly to the container. It looks like it's in front of the ship. Or inside, maybe? Yeah, I'm not sure where I put that. Maybe we can only see it from here? Container is... Argon Wharf. Confusing. I don't know where the container is. Okay. Fly to container. That's deliver suitable ship there. Is that the container? No, that's the wharf itself. Okay, so dropping this may have been a small mistake. Gonna set that to inactive. The container is allegedly around here somewhere. I do not see the container. I may have to go get additional antimatter cells. Hmm. Container is allegedly dead ahead. Is it inside the wharf? I definitely do not see it. And perhaps I have to be outside of the docking bay to request permission. I guess we'll just leave and turn around. And maybe Contain. now. Ah, I can select it. Argon Wharf. Okay, so we're going to need to request docking permission. Docking granted. And now Contain. we select this. And we see that the container is over here. Okay. Well, that's certainly going to be interesting. 
So it's about 12 meters below us. Allegedly. We don't seem to be able to select it like this. Maybe there's a room down here to pick it up in? No? Okay. Well, this is certainly awkward. And we can't just select it when we're on the ground. I think it might have clipped through. That is certainly interesting. I'll have to figure out the proper way to do that because this is definitely not the proper way. I mean, 12 meters below. Surely this is further than 12 meters. Okay. So that's our vanguard down there. And I think we're just going to have to go get additional antimatter. I don't think we can get this back. So what we could, in theory, do is A, we undock, and it looks to me like that container actually disappeared. Okay. Elite Vanguard. So we can have that Elite Vanguard come over this way, and I want it to... Purchase. Hmm. Why can't we purchase antimatter shells here? Or antimatter cells? Ah, uh, because I don't actually have it selected. Right, right, right. So this one would come trade with the antimatter cell factory and purchase three cells. Like that. Okay, and they're off. Excellent. We will, for now, accompany them. Okay, they cruised off in this direction. That's fine. Definitely booking it. I'm assuming that they went this way. Nope, they went the other way. That's fine. We'll go around this way. Because we're going to want to come out over this way. And actually, we may as well just autopilot, autopilot this. The autopilot does not seem interested in leaving the highway now, the way that the uh, thing says that it should. Interesting. It's no longer interested in us leaving. So I guess the autopilot knows what it's doing. <laughs> Hopefully, anyway. Okay, so we have... Entering These guys Parking heading on Prime. over. That should be fine. We just got another payment from our ice miner, so that is perfect. And we're just going to have that low but consistent money coming in, which Entering is what we are going system. to use to begin the construction of our empire. Entering system. True Pretty soon we're going to want to get a freighter system set up, probably. But that is definitely a job for another episode. For right now, I do want to get this ship sent over. So they're a little bit ahead of us right now, but we'll get caught up. 
I'm not sure if we have better equipment or not. Entering system. Pontifex's claim. Besides, we have less far to go than they do since they have to swing over and pick up those antimatter shells. I keep saying shells. They are, in fact, cells. Hmm, there's a recon fighter over there. Certainly awkward. I'm not entirely sure what you're planning here, autopilot. That was very awkward. Well, I mean, that's the autopilot for you. So we will have our headquarters done quite soon, and once we do, that will change things. We'll have to figure out how we want to expand our headquarters, of course. Let's see, where is our friend at? Our friend is currently up over here. That's fine. Our mining vessel is, looks like, mining, which is exactly what it should be doing. Nope, it is gathering resources. Perfect. Oh, we're going to be jumping into Grand Exchange momentarily. Actually, no, we aren't. We're going to be jumping over here into Nop... Nop... Nopalios? I'm going to go with... It's about to say. Nopalius. No okay. Good to know. Well, we'll just travel up over here. And I do want to say all this traveling is not something that is going to be a regular occurrence once we actually get going in this game. So that's going to be a thing. Can we Entering remotely system. order ships? Grand exchange. We may be able to dispatch someone to go there. I did not mean to enter the save menu. Autopilot. I meant to Engage. activate the autopilot. And we'll head up over this way, but I do want to make this guy active. Autopilot. Disengaged. Okay. Autopilot. Engaged. So we will head over there and check on the status of our ship that we sent after the antimatter cells. Looks like that will be jumping momentarily. Specifically, right now. Excellent. And it is on its way over. Fantastic. And of course, simultaneously, we are about to get ourselves another 8,667 credits. Our mining ship is docking up as we speak. Well, I feel like we have a decent start here, but the start to an X game is always quite slow, at least in my experience as a not very experienced player of X games. <laughs> there we go. Just got our ice payment. That's pretty fantastic. Okay, well, it is pretty much time to put a cut in, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring these guys up off camera to this location, and hopefully not crash into an asteroid with the autopilot. It looks like we're pretty clear now. So I'll bring these guys up off camera, and we'll be ready to begin this next, uh, next step at the beginning of next episode. You can leave your offerings to the Engagement Gods in the form of likes, comments, subscribes, and bell ringings, and I will see you all next time.